Okay, in this quick tutorial we're going to take a look at how to update the windows um, if you've started your design in 2D design. So let's say you've put a window in and um, you've exported your design through to uh, VR but now you need to edit this window. You have to change the size perhaps or uh, delete it. Um, now you can't do this directly from 2D design because if you uh, export it will delete it. Okay, so what we would do is we'd start off by saving our um, file. So we just go file save as, uh, save the file. <clears throat> and now the next thing you're going to do is go through to modeling design. And then you're going to go to the file menu and choose import 2D design file. Browse for wherever you've saved that file, click open. Click OK. Uh, before you do that, um, you just have to specify your wall height. I know my wall height, I'm at a 2.8 meters. So I'm going to put that in there, click OK. And now you'll see it's the program generates that 2D design straight into our 3D side. Now we can do our uh, alterations. So let's say I wanted to actually just delete that window and uh, have a solid wall there. What I'll do is in my VR, I would go and delete this uh, wall and this window. I would then go back to modeling design. Let's get rid of that as well. Um, so here's modeling design. Do exactly the same here. So delete that. We can use the update function to fix this wall up. And now what we can do is just simply use export merge. Okay. Well, I'm using advanced export merge and uh, there you go so now we've uh, gotten rid of that wall uh, that window and we've got a plain wall uh, even if you wanted to add more windows perhaps the same thing applies um, you just go back to your modeling design go to your library add whatever sort of windows you want now let's put two into this uh, wall here one there and then one down here and then do exactly the same thing again. We can just use export merge. Select everything that you want to send through. So I like using advanced export merge. And uh, there you go. So it's as simple as that. That's exactly how you'll update your design from 2D design.